name of the show. Our next guest is someone who did trend on Twitter. Now, he is someone who's very vocal on social media. He just did not know that this tweet was going to attract that much attention. In fact, there's someone online who had said, Niapa Kenya too, it doesn't take much for someone to be famous. And let me tell you, this is not the way. He would have loved the country and other people to know him. But alas, here we are. Kevin Boyer tweeted that he was going to surprise his girlfriend on her birthday. We were like, oh my gosh, if he wanted to, he would. Do not, you know, accept any less. Ladies, you can see what other men are doing for other girlfriends. It was just, it was a whole thing. But then he just didn't tweet after that. And everyone was waiting. Bated breath. Tunashindwa, what happened? And so he's here to explain what it is that happened. Kevin Boya, welcome to the trend. Thank you. Sasa. Kwa sana. Yani bado umebebana na ile maua? Eh, ini yako. Oh, ini yangu. Mimi ni yako nimekuletea. Thank you. At least wewe ni surprise ukanipata. Ndio. Yes, wewe hujahepa. Thank you. Thank you Kevin. How are you though? I'm doing fine. You're doing fine? Yeah. You're doing better now? I'm really trying mentally. Uh, you're, you're healing, yes. I understand. Yeah. Thank, pole you. Pole too. Thank you for this. Mm, but then, carry. you know, what's brought you on the show is something that I know a lot of men will just, you know, just, you know you'll downplay it, but it's painful to surprise someone who is not there. Sure. So this was your tweet. If we can have that on the screen, it's right behind me. I have traveled all the way from Nairobi to Kwale to come and surprise my girlfriend on her birthday. I haven't texted or called her in the last 24 hours. She maybe thinks I forgot it's her birthday. I am uh, waiting for her just outside. Oh, I'm waiting for her just outside her office to surprise her. I hope it goes well. <coughs> we all hoped it went well, but I understand the story didn't go so well. So what happened, Kevin? Mm, just as you said, mm -hmm. <coughs> sorry, it never went well. Mambo ilichemka. Ilichemka. Che che che. Yeah. Where? So we were talking Nairobi. Mm -hmm. I mean, of course, you can't call her and tell her, Bibi Nakusa. There was no one else you were talking to, maybe a colleague, mm. her friend who's also in Kwale. Mm. What planning went behind this? Of course, I was not talking to anyone because I wanted it to be a, like a surprise. For her? Yeah, so ilikuwa tu chinya maji. Si kutaka ataju hata naenda. No, ukutaka mtu yote mwingine, labda mpange pamoja. Mm -mm. Just me. Not even my shadow, just me. <laughs> so how long have you been together with this young lady? Mm, we have dated for two years, but generally we have for three years. Okay. Mm, so one year to Joanna, then two years to date. Uh, have you spoken till now? No. You haven't spoken yet? Yeah. Okay, so you get to Kwale. Tell me what happened. So when I got to Kwale, I went to her office. Mm -hmm. Then I waited at the reception. So the, the receptionist went and called her, but... Uh, after she was told I was around, I don't know what happened, but we never got to see each other. Mm. Then some other things happened, which maybe I don't feel comfortable sharing because maybe I, I don't want to expose her. I, I, I like, uh, I just respect her privacy. She still hasn't talked to you though? Not yet. Okay. Yeah. Does she know that this has blown up on social media? Does she have any... Mm, I'm not sure because recently even I'm, I'm not able to see her profile pictures on WhatsApp. So, okay. Yeah. So has she blocked you? I, I'm not really sure. You're not sure if she's yeah, blocked you? Yeah. Now there's so many people who are saying that this is just a publicity stunt. Nikiki, uyu Kevin Boya tunamjua, manze, itu ni uongo. What do you say to that? See, people, people are saying that because ideally when people, watu hiko sana, what I expect, maybe you attach some evidence to show things went wrong. Mm. And some of the evidence that people prefer in screenshots, maybe the, your conversation, maybe you start, unanza to see your partner, mm. ama maybe come mm. on either video, some pictures you post. Yeah. But me, I never took that route. So at the end of the day, uh, what people really wanted me to do, ile wa mezoya. Wanazoya mm. kwa sana, maybe you unfollow each other. Maybe Mnanza Kutusiana, we are share screenshots, we are not to But me, me nearly respect her privacy. Pia niliona, si kuona kama is a good route to take. So you were surprised that this, you know, blew up? Yeah. 
Okay. Yes. But, you know, you sharing any one of those things mm -hmm. legitimizes and adds credibility to your story. Yes. Because, I mean, from where a lot of people are sitting, myself included, Kevin, I'm like, uh, I'm going to enjoy. Mm -hmm. I'm going to enjoy. There was no quality. Mm -hmm. You were just here in Nairobi. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just like, ah, I love Ukanyamaza for 48 hours. Yes. I don't know. It was just, it was questionable. Okay. Here for eight hours, I was, I was going through some, something very difficult because, see, traveling all the way to go and see someone, they, they, they actually really end on a weekday. So they don't even, like, maybe appreciate your time, we spare everything that. So, siku filipoa, so ni kamwa kwanza ni Then, kuna some time I came online, then kapata kulikuwa na a lot of trolls, people mm. are spreading misinformation, a lot of unhealthy banter, so ni kasema. Maybe it was not time for me to focus on that, that, that kind of energy. I just focus on myself. Mm. Yeah. Like Kevin see Uli post picture Fulani, and you are with a certain lady mm. of Caucasian, ca Caucasian mm -hmm. descent. Mm. And you know, you alluded to the fact that there was more than just friendship between you and the lady. Sasa kama walikuwa umependa mtu mbaka umeenda kwa msurprise kule kwa uneza kwa ume move on that fast within one week. Not really, but uh -huh. vena, kuna vena, I'm really trying to do so. Unajua, <laughs> unajua when no. such, such kind of things happen, <laughs> it's not really the end of life. It's then, not. yeah, if you, if you find someone when you want to accommodate, and you want to Within one week, Kevin. It's possible. 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 It's Mm, she has confirmed that you are dating, but I'm planning to visit her country. She's also planning to do other things with me. Which other things are these you're planning to do together? Also, what you I'll say later. Not you will say later. Yeah. Ah, so you have a manager. I see you have a team. Yes. Right. Yes. So why do you have a team, Kevin? If my mm. research, you know, served yes. me right, yes. you are a social media strategist. Yeah. You have an agency that runs different media companies, no, yes. not media companies, sorry, that you run, yes. you know, the social media accounts of different companies. So this is in your world. Yeah. So why do you have a management team? Okay, I, I, th I thought it was, it was good to have uh, so, uh, a team that really guides me because after all that happened, Mm -hmm. And some people thought that it was maybe wise to work with me. Mm -hmm. uh, so people, people started approaching me and it, it, it became a, a little bit difficult for me to do it alone. So I thought it, it was a good idea maybe if I looked for a manager and some other members of the team who can now help me maybe to, to talk better with the people who think maybe we can work together. Especially because they know maybe I, I'm, I'm, I am able to, for example, maybe do digital strategy for them, mm -hmm. maybe to push their products online, maybe to, to push their services online. Also, some people approached me because they thought I, I did the right thing to come out and speak. Because you see, according to how things are, especially in the African context, mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's not like when, when, men, when men come out and speak, especially after what I went through, some people trying to link them, some people trying stigmatizing them. But some people thought that I did a good thing by coming out and speaking what, what, what I went through without really necessarily attacking the other person, without exposing them by just respecting their privacy. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. Well, now, I, you know, there's a chance of you being an influencer yes. and making money. Yeah, You've exactly. been approached by brands. Yeah. Oh, wow. So you could make money yes. from this sing single tweet. That wasn't True. supposed to mean much. True. Actually, I'm, I'm, I'm very grateful to those people that are, are expressing their interest in working with me. I'm also grateful to like, people like the Expeditions Maasai Safaris mm -hmm. who saw the need to treat a boy child mm. who had gone through a lot of things. So they took me to Mombasa. They paid my trip for three days. I was, I, I was also able to meet the, um, that beautiful lady over there, courtesy of them because it, it, it's them who, who made me to be there, so of course interacted with her. Kevin, so, yeah. stop. Yeah, 
mase bro na nimaliza una una nimaliza sana so they're the ones who introduced you to this lady or they made it no, possible no. for you to meet because she was also on holiday yeah the fact that okay. they facilitated my movement there oh, then she was among the people in that hotel Aha. then I, i was able to use my my communication skills of course my yeah. social skills to to know more about her and things went well okay yes so kevin i can see you have your phone yeah. uh, my producer mm. if you just give him your phone mm. with your the girlfriend your girlfriend's number and we call her to just confirm that this story is accurate and it is legitimate and it's mm. not cloud chasing mm. can we do that not really. I'm, I'm I'm not the kind of person who exposes private private We're not going life. to expose her name. We're not going to expose her name. Mm. We're but just going to give her a call. But I don't think she will be comfortable. True, and I it's don't not think it's a lie and yes. you're not just trying to chase cloud. Mm. And also why do you care if she's comfortable or not if she wasted your time and you were heartbroken to the point that now you needed someone else to comfort you mm. as you're healing mm. because of how heartbroken you are? If it is indeed real then we should be able to call her right why are you protecting her why do you care so much about her if she doesn't care about you at all to contact you till now and it's been more than a week oh you are talking about the other one in Kwale yes oh okay what what i believe in is when when things go wrong you move on from whatever happened so says to kasana ku base on what happened Currently China has attacked me to base now on like some positive vibes like on my mental wellness like me trying to do soko in a better way me trying to do things that zinani pay positive vibes yeah okay yes <laughs> look at your team you have a team of four people who came with you today yes because of a tweet i d- i don't know do you guys believe mm. do you guys believe this Why don't you want us to call her? We don't we're not going to say her name. Mm, I don't think we, we will get her so like your ex don't. your ex I could call maybe on air like And is any pigia if I'm trying to prove that there's nothing I'm lying about of mm, course mm. very few people believe what it is that you said. It just sounds yes. like one of those things where you want to go viral mm. and trend and then you come on the trend such as now but it's not a legitimate story. I think so people who are doubting me, you see the people people who are around me like my circle even know that that girl. But people who are doubting me maybe are people who are not within my inner circle. And also there are people I can say maybe there are ni wale watu wanataka kuni push to a next mile. I do what I don't believe in like you see if size ni kitoka ni post screenshot of our conversation maybe showing her name and everything. Yeah. People now start believing. But now because I'm not doing that is there ndo maana kuna hiyo room unapata people wana wanaanza ku doubt like but watu watu wako karibu na mimi they can even mimi. tell you the three names of that lady Kevin so you want to tell me that this is a true story and you said for the full video go check out my youtube channel like every other artist who cloud chases before mm. a song before they release a song or when they want people to just go to their youtube channel why did we need to go to your youtube channel if indeed you were going through something really difficult mm. you were hurt and you were trying to heal mm. and you wanted to discuss mental health mm. people didn't have to go to your youtube channel for that did they yeah true but you see the reason why I, i decided to share that video on my channel was the day i came i was really tired but then i realized that kulikuwa na some people are really waiting for me to say something then see quarter because most people expected me kwenda kwa tita like i do a thread mm-hmm. but nilikuwa tired so that's why i decided to fanya a video i think a yeah. one minute because niliona within that that ka video i can communicate at least and tell people i'm safe because people are really scared some people even were spreading mis- misinformation that see, that, that me even even me commit page, suicide hey. <coughs> anyway do you believe that cloud chasing gets the numbers gets you the work and gets you the business and it's actually an approach that most entertainers should take for me i don't believe so but for some people maybe it works but for me you see the post that i did it was uh, when ilikuwa na, t- na tweet your tweet i never expected it at it a blow you see just the way you take your phone and you take a selfie and post the difference was me i took pictures <coughs> of the flowers and yeah. post twitter other people take their photos and post on other platform yeah. the same way people are nasema at it was the necessary for me to do a video on youtube you see as long as nime communicate a response on any of my social media platforms i don't see why it should be a problem yeah yeah okay yes. well anyway um 
I, I think it's romantic. I am a hopeless romantic. I really do hope that it is true yeah. and that, you know, you really went out of your way to surprise this uh, young lady who... Uh, so you don't even know where the, the relationship stands as of right now. Yeah. Ama, you just think it ended without any proper communication? Yeah, I, personally, I just think it ended. That's why I actually decided to use that story now yeah. to motivate even a lot of men who are going through the same but they don't have that opportunity maybe they are fearing maybe they are fearing that people will stigmatize them or tawatenga you see sisi when you come out and talk as men people say when it's simp like when i bought those flowers for her actually she was the first person i ever bought flowers for but people started saying when it's simp actually i think the tweet went viral because of the flowers because normally we are not used to buying flowers especially in mm. kenya so i want to make it look like it's a normal thing yeah. Especially even for men, because even in Kenya, we only buy flowers for men may maybe when they die. That's true. But it can, if you can normalize that action so that whenever you are in a position to just buy flowers for people, then allow people to come out and talk. Because yeah. for me, that was a very painful experience. So when, when you allow people to come out and talk and you don't, you don't like banter them, you don't discourage them, it becomes a good thing, especially yeah. the boy child. That's true. Yeah. That is true. They do yeah. only get flowers on the true. day that they die. Very well, sad. anyway, Kevin, now that you're in a new situation, I hope mm. it, you know, it yes. will, you know, you'll be happier. Um, I hope you'll heal from what this did true. to you, I guess. Yeah, I had tired. to ask the tough, hard questions that people mm. ask online. So I'm mm. sorry I was the one who had mm. to play the devil's advocate. Still but okay. thank you. And mm. thank you for this. So I am the second woman he's bought flowers for yeah. if she was the <coughs> first one. Osoro, I am going to buy you flowers next week. Uh, I have to make sure that you get flowers on the show. I want to give you your flowers. Kevin Boyer, the young man who trended on Twitter saying that he's mm. going to surprise his girlfriend. Mm. The surprise did not go as planned and now everyone seems to just be talking yeah. about him. Thank and you so much. Before you show. finish, yes? I'd also like to say that, you see, the, the whole conversation is a very wide thing. So I, I would like to welcome on board eh? everyone who thinks that we can, we can do something for those who are going through all these kind of hardships. The heartbreak, especially for the boy child that Maybe we can come together and do something. So maybe the people can reach me on my social media platforms. On Twitter, it is at kmboya underscore. On Instagram, it is at kevinboya underscore. Uh, TikTok and YouTube, it's at kevinboya underscore. All right. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much, Kevin. Welcome. Okay. So we are about to take a short break. Are we taking a break?